Oh, give me five. Right? Yeah. I love it, man. All right, fist bump. Love it. Fist bump. Fist bump. Fist bump. Fist bump. Fist uh, oh. Did you see the movie already? Not yet. I heard it's really good. It looks a lot of fun. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm it's unbelievable. You. It's unbelievable. Yeah. You so don't tell me about your description of those glasses. I can't even. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. So tell me about your character in the movie. Uh, I played myself. That was the best thing I've ever done in my whole life. Just play myself. Typecasting. And absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> and I could be as ornery as I wanted to be. Oh wow. Yeah. This is it. So, so you, you played two different characters in the original Star Trek. The original Star Trek, right. Yeah. Uh, I didn't know why they picked me. I thought, why didn't they get an old guy for Captain Pike? But they did do that. Makeup. And yeah. so uh, that started me, and then I went to Lieutenant DePaul the second season. Yeah. And then they had to put a damn Russian in there. But Gene was very uh -huh. smart. He said, you are a good actor. And I said, wow, thank you. And he said, I'm going to write a letter to all the casting people, and you're going to get work. And I said, and two weeks later, I'm on Get Smart. Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. So I worked for 18, 19 years. Yeah, it looks that. like that, that, that wound healed up quite nicely. Oh, yeah, yeah. From Captain Pike. Like, they had it on the wrong side on the oh. last day. They were so tired. They put the scar <laughs> on the wrong side. Oh. And I went, wait a minute, guys. What's wrong with this picture? And I said, you put it on the wrong Oh, God, Kenny. Oh, we would have been $10,000 a minute. Screw it. We would have been fired. Wow. No, true, what a mix-up. True story. Oh, hey, so tell me, were you doing the beeps yourself? Yes, I did. You and were? I moved the cart myself. <laughs> I had a joystick and a breaker. Wow. Yep. We're getting all the true stories true here stories. on they the Nerd Soapbox. Right. Oh. Tape my eyes down, eat through a straw. Oh, wow. Lost 20 pounds. Really? Yep. Wow. How long did that take? Uh, a week or so? Eight days. Whoa. Okay, okay. Eight days. Wow. Yep. Hey, tell me, uh, I, I hear you have an uh, autobiography? Yes, we do. You do? Uh, it's What's it called? Captain Pike Found Alive. Okay. Buy it. It's getting five out of five at, at um, uh, what is it, um, what's that company that, <laughs> I hate to say their name, no, but they're very good. Uh, the company that uh, sponsors it, what is the name of it? Come on, guys. Um, anyway, it's yeah, getting yeah. five out of five at Amazon. Oh. oh. <laughs> and so How that's How could you good. forget? My first, my first bio. So nice. anyway, yeah, it's okay. a memoir. Oh. It's a memoir. Yes, of so. you in the films, in the film industry? Yes. And it's all about little little pity patters about I worked overseas, I worked in Mexico, I worked I worked a lot of places. Oh. Yeah. And weren't you on billboards too? Yes. Winston man. I didn't smoke. Oh, never no, smoked, but no smoke. Okay, okay. Anyway, so nice. I gotta go. Well thanks, got for, thanks for talking to us. Good talking all right. with you. you. Flick. You got a good Flick voice. the nerd soapbox. Like, hey, give me five, man. Woo. All right. Wow. Captain Pike. Yep. And DePaul from the original series. Let's see who else we could find.